I'm Kate Rich. I am a certified childbirth educator and postpartum and infant care doula. And today I'm going to be sharing um, another uh, breastfeeding hold. Uh, so this position is called the cradle hold. This is probably the position that we're most familiar with when you think of breastfeeding. Most people are thinking about this position. Um, the thing about it is that this uh, cradle hold position is usually a little bit better for a baby who is a little bit older and has a little bit more head and neck control. And that's also a little bit easier for you once you are a little bit more comfortable and established with breastfeeding. So although it's the, the position that we think of probably most commonly, it may not be uh, the best first position to try, but might be better to try down the line. Although, as I always tell moms, if you're comfortable, if your baby is latching well and they're comfortable and happy, then it doesn't matter what position you get into. Um, so in the cradle hold, we're going to have the baby um, nestled into the arm that is on the same side as the breast that you're going to be feeding on. So if I'm feeding on this side, then this arm is going to be the arm that is supporting the bulk of the baby's weight. In this position, um, the baby's head is right there in the crook of my arm, and I want to try to move them so that they are nipple to nose, so that they get um, a nice wide open latch when they go to open their mouth. Um, then my arm is going down the back of their body, and I kind of tuck my arms, this baby's a little short, but um, I tuck the, my hand right in there, right behind the baby, and kind of give them some support to their arms and legs. And then um, I also want to make sure that I'm holding the baby nice and snug up against my chest, not letting the baby roll away. So as I've talked about in other videos, it's very difficult, even for you, to take a drink of water if you've got your neck turned to the side. So you want to make sure that the baby always stays in that nice alignment, their head, neck, shoulders, body. And we do that by rolling them and tucking them securely up against your body. This hand is then free to help, you know, position the baby, position your breast. Um, again, it's a little bit more tricky because you're reaching in there with where the baby's body is. Um, and then you also are not having as much control over where their head and neck goes. It's just kind of nestled in there, but you don't have as much control as in some of the other positions, which is why this one might be a little bit easier, um, a little bit down the line um, as you get more established with breastfeeding. Um, and in this position, again, too, we can take some pillows, however you feel most supported and comfortable, you know, put those under those arms there. Um, if you're lying back, this can be a good position just to use gravity. Um, but if you're sitting forward, you know, stacking some pillows or something under there to help hold the baby in that position for a while can be helpful.